Hello, hello. I'm Natalie, your acupuncturist and weight loss coach. This week we're talking more about how do we avoid holiday weight gain. Sunday is Halloween, and so we are definitely cruising into the holiday season. And is it, it is important to start putting some awareness and attention on, um, you know, what we want to have happen moving forward. And so we do tend to gain weight over the holidays just due to the fact that we, you know, are eating more rich foods and we're exercising a little less because it's cold outside and there's a little bit of booze around and we're kind of treating ourselves a little. And it's important not to let that go off the deep end because you know, the holidays will end in January and then you're going to be left to deal with the aftermath of whatever that is. So getting your head in the game ahead of time, I think is a really great strategy. And why not start with Halloween? So in my, you know, mind's eye, when I think of Halloween, I think of candy. And if you're walking through the grocery store right now, you are seeing crap loads of cheap candy, widely available after Halloween, it's going to go on, you know, clearance discount. You're going to be able to get all that crap that you want for a super sweet price. But is that really a super sweet price when you think about the cost that it has on your body? So really the answer is no. (laughs) I think a great strategy for, um, you know, keeping the weight off is to not buy the junk. Don't have it around. We are biologically programmed, programmed evolutionarily to go back and eat all of the sweet food until it is gone. Because in nature, there's not a lot of sweet food. So if you found yourself a little bit of honey or you found yourself a berry patch, your brain was gonna memorize exactly where that spot was and you were gonna keep going back and going back and going back until it was gone. So that same mentality applies towards candy. So having it there is just tempting you. Why set yourself up to fail? Give it away, throw it away, don't buy it, avoid having it, and that will be a huge, huge factor in not eating it because if it's not there you can't eat it i think it's really important to take responsibility for yourself if you have these issues of you know temptation and not being able to avoid that thing don't have that thing in your house have that thing you know at a party and then don't take any of it home with you so you can keep that portion control going so really step one is don't buy the crap avoid having the crap around because then you won't feel the need to eat it till it's gone and don't think that you can cheat evolution because it's just not that simple So hopefully you found that to be helpful. We're going to be talking more this week about some other strategies I think that you'll um, be able to use to help keep that holiday weight from, you know, accumulating around your waistline. And I hope that you have an awesome day. Take good care of yourself and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.